That's how I feel about traffic. Just blah. That's all. It's the only emotion you can feel. Good morning, everybody. Happy Thursday. I had to remember what day it is. I um, kind of sort of slept in this morning. I mean, like, 8.30 for me is sort of sleeping in because I'm usually up earlier than that to go to mass, but slept in a little bit. Now I'm heading down to school, and it's sort of getting chilly. It's like 70 degrees outside, which when you're used to, like, 85, 90 degree weather, 70 degrees is pretty chilly, pretty brisk, but I enjoy it. I like... I like the fall. I like cold weather. Well, not cold, cold weather. I like chilly weather where I can just put on like a jacket or something. It's just what I like. So I'm happy that it's almost here. And we're almost at October. My birthday is like a week away. I've been waiting forever for this birthday. So <sighs> it's almost here. Sitting in line for parking is bringing back very bad memories. And I'm hoping this doesn't take two and a half hours. I'm hoping it takes like two and a half minutes to park. Because this this isn't looking good, guys. Not looking good at all. I'll tell you what. I don't know if I have like an idealistic view of driving and staying in lines. But like if you're in a line and someone pulls up next to you and wants to cut in front of you. And they cut the entire line. I, I, I'm not going to let them in. And, like, I don't know if that's a bad thing, if that's, like, ethically sound to not let someone in, but there's obviously a line, and you obviously disregarded the entire thing and had no respect for anyone in the line and just jumped right in. Someone just did it, and it just, like, it irks me. It just gets at something in me. And it's, I don't know what it is, and I don't know if, like, it's right to not let them in or if I should just be the bigger person and say, all right, you're a jerk, but I'm going to let you in. Yeah, it's rough, but I didn't have to let the guy in. He went six cars ahead of me, and I had only waited 10 minutes to get to the point I was at, and he just came right up. So I'm happy for you, sir. I'm glad that you got to park so quickly, and I didn't. Heading out for the day, so I'm done for the week. It's actually really chilly right now. I wish I had like a jacket with me because match are pretty cold which is weird and I was talking this morning Whew, I'm out of breath I think I was talking this morning how I'm excited for like the colder weather to come but when I'm not prepared for it I'm not as excited because I don't have like a jacket to actually wear in the cold weather but whew, we uh, talked about alien in film class today pretty exciting day in my opinion but I'm a film student so I guess that's why I find it exciting that would be logical I made myself some chicken fried rice with teriyaki sauce looks good just like that hair that's on the camera uh, I didn't show you how I made it because it was so like all over the place like pan here pan there and when I don't have uh, someone else to film I can't show you because I'm all over the place and I don't want to burn things and I want to cook it well and I'm gonna try it and let you guys know how it is because I hope it's good. I, uh, it's the first time I've ever made it. Like I've made fried rice, but I've never made chicken teriyaki with it. So I'll let you guys know how it is. I burnt my tongue on my chicken teriyaki because I was just too excited. Just wanted to eat it. So I ate it as quick as I could and I burnt my tongue, but it tasted good. It was really good stuff for a first time making it. If I make it a few times, it's gonna be perfecto. But uh, going to go to mass now because I didn't get up this morning. But the good thing is that we have a lot of options around here. So I'm going to go to 7 o'clock mass. Got 30 minutes to get over there. Don't know where I'm going. It's at St. Patrick's. I've been there once. So I have an idea, a vague idea of where it's at. So let's try and find this place. I only thought I was going to see traffic twice today. But now it's a third time. And it's raining, which makes it... Even, blah, that's how I feel about traffic. Just blah, that's all, it's the only emotion you can feel. I made it to St. Patrick's, went to Mass. Uh, I didn't record anything because it's raining and I was gonna record going in but it was raining and I didn't want my camera to get wet. 
And when I got in there, I was like lost because um, a lot of the prisoners here are Hispanic, so a lot of the signs are in Spanish. So I was like, I don't know where the chapel is, and I can't read these signs. So I went into, I almost walked into like a parent meeting for something, I assume, a meeting of some sort that I wasn't supposed to be at. And I realized it, so I walked away, and then I found the chapel. So it's quite the experience. But it was just, it was cool, because it's a little chapel, and like they had adoration before, um, and then after mass also. So like uh, we were singing like uh, Tanta Mergo and like O Salutaris, which are like um, common Catholic hymns for the beginning and end of adoration, for those of you who don't know. And it's just beautiful to listen to in such a small chapel because it just rings out with everybody singing it. And it's just cool to see how rich in tradition the Catholic Church is and just how grateful I am to belong to such a beautiful church. And it's just great. So I'm glad that I came tonight and I was able to see that. It was fantastic. I'm going to uh, work on getting the vlogs up. Made myself a nice little milkshake. Hanging out with Hattie. Um, but... I'm uh, I'm watching Chopped too because I just like to make fun of Chopped and all the stories that people come up with. But gonna catch up on the vlog, at least like getting them edited and uploaded. Um, I'm not too far behind, but I'm still behind. So I want to get ahead, stay ahead. It's very hard for me. I know I struggle with it, and I'm terrible, the worst vlogger ever. But uh, at least I get them up. At least it's not like. Hey, a year later, here's your vlog. No, I'll, it'll, maybe a week, maybe, maybe. I realized as I was editing that I have my boots here, and it looks very odd. Let me put all of my shoes up so that Addie can't eat them, because she eats them if they're on the floor. That's why my boots are up here. It's late, it's like 12.14, so I'm gonna head to bed. I'm going to the movies for like the first time since Ant-Man tomorrow, so I'm excited. I'm gonna go see Everest, so I'll have a review up in two days. Um, I'm gonna let you guys know what I think. So, until then, choose virtue, choose life. So long for now. Kevin, <laughs> can you record this as my assistant? No. Not, you don't have to say my name is Kevin. Just like, this is Tom Jake's office.